is up guys welcome back to some more scarlet nexus last time we uh went into the uh chronos terminal i believe that was called inside the kunad gate and we were fixing entanglements which are basically supposed to stop this thing from expanding and uh but we found out that um one yuito's mother being here caused another entanglement so she had to go back unfortunately and she did uh she did die for normal time and 20, uh, 2009. And we also found out that uh, Karin, when Karin stole Kasane's power and then resonated with Yuito, he did indeed go back to the past. And now he's changing things, which are causing more entanglements. And uh, according to everyone else, as far as we know, only people who have caused entanglements can fix them. So we have to go find Karin now and make him fix the entanglements he's causing so we can stop all this. But it's probably not going to go that smooth. Other than that, we were uh, finishing up uh, this round of bonding events. I don't know if this is the last one or not, because a lot of people are getting to six, but we'll, we'll just have to see. And I also ended up... Uh, I did manage to get all the items I needed for uh, everybody's gifts. So I have every gift for up to now, and I've done, uh, I believe, every side quest that became available. So... Uh, who did we leave off with last time? Uh, I think Samuki is just a... Did I, did I have any gifts for her? No. That's for the team bond event. Um, so I did... I know we finished Luka last time. And if I was going in order... Did we do Shiden? We did not do Shiden. Alright, let's do Shiden then. I'll just double check everyone. Just in case. Everybody's right, not level six. Not bad. Hey, don't overdo it. Yeah. Thanks, Shiden. That was awfully straightforward. Listen, I'm not being friendly with you. It's just that keeping yourself in good condition. What are you doing? I hate when you make that stupid face. Hmm. All right. Oh, we got two things: prolonged effect and uh, shock, ne shock negation. That's good. It's good being able to push each other to greater heights. I I'm not necessarily talking about us, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh. But I'm hoping our relationship is like that. Exactly. Thinking exactly like Yuito now. Got this guy. All right. Ooh, a storm photo. This looks cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Damn, he really likes uh, landscape pictures. And they're hung up. Ooh. Right. I think we have two more to give him? No, one more. Slightly light dog bell. I guess he likes to train, uh, train and be more lean. Hmm than to be bulk up like Luca. Alright, oh, you teleport. Uh, where did he go? Go in here? Oh, he did. What the? Where did he go? Like, a blind? She did. Kagero. Did did he just leave? Oh no, he's over here. Okay. <laughs> I completely missed him if I if he showed up. All right, on event. Let's see. Are you going she somewhere, Shiden? Yeah. I'm going to see the thunderclouds. Thunderclouds? Is there a storm coming in? Is it safe to be outside? Apparently these are the biggest in decades. This is a chance to see real lightning. It's a little dangerous, but I can't pass it up. Wow. Now that I think of it, I've only ever seen images of real lightning. Oh, I don't mind if you tag along, if you're interested. Sounds fun. I'll take you up on that. All right, then get ready. 
We'll miss the thunderclouds if we take too long. I've never seen him this excited. Yeah, he actually didn't uh, throw an insult at us. See those big black clouds over there? Those are thunderclouds. Cumulonimbus. Wow, cool. The clouds look like mountains. So the lightning will come from there? The forecast said it should be soon. I wonder what kind of lightning it'll be. You really like lightning, don't you? Is it because of your power? Yeah. It feels familiar. And it might give me a clue for using my power. I also love the remote and powerful image of lightning. I'd like to be like that. Remote and powerful. That does sound like him. Oh! A lightning strike! Did you see that? Yeah, that's crazy. I just kind of tagged along. But this is way better than I expected. Whoa, that was close. Jeez. I saw it so clearly. Hey, Shiden, lightning is really cool. Damn right. <laughs> what did you expect? Why do you sound so proud? <laughs> it's so beautiful. That powerful light. I've never seen anything like it. Yeah. Clouds are breaking up. It's over. Ah, that was awesome. It was. You seem down. Are you sad that it's gone? Yeah. But it got me thinking, too. Compared to that awesome force, my power is nothing. Well, you're up against a natural phenomenon. Of course a human can't stand up to that. I know that. It's not just lightning. Even compared to other people, I'm weak. I wanted to be as strong as Captain Seto someday. I thought if I worked hard, I could be a Septentrion. I worked for years like that, but I still have no title. I'm still just... Shiden. I know that I'm stronger than I was before, but maybe this is as strong as I'm going to get. That's not like you. Is earning the title of Septentrion that important? Of course it is. It's the OSF's proof of strength. If I have it, no one can say I'm not good enough. I don't disagree that the Septentrions are amazing, but there are powerful people like Arashi that don't have any special titles. You're strong too. I think so, and so does everybody else. Well, I think it's more of... <laughs> Didn't Arashi enough? mention she didn't want any titles because she wants more responsibility? my strength. So that everyone has to accept it. The reason everyone appreciated Captain Seto wasn't just because of his strength in battle. He was able to move people. He encouraged them and made them brave. He had strengths that I don't have. My plan was to use this mask once I thought I had reached his level. But if that day won't come, then maybe I shouldn't have it. Don't say that. Captain Seto had it made just for you. He had this mask made because he thought I would become strong like him. As long as I can't meet those expectations, I can't wear it. Don't be stupid. That's not Captain Seto's mask. It's your mask. So you have to use it. You don't have to be like him. What? I look up to him too, but his strength is different from ours, just like you said. And it's fine that it's different. Each of us are strong in our own ways. Strong in my own way. Pretty wise words for a rookie. I was being a little arrogant, but you know what I mean. In his message, Captain Seto did say that I should trust my own strength. He knew even back then what I was lacking. Oh, I don't know. Looks like I've been worrying about the wrong things. Lightning's beauty isn't meant to be compared to anyone else. And it doesn't exist to receive a title. It just exists. And it's known throughout the world. That's the strength I need. You look like you feel better. <laughs> I wasn't feeling bad in the first place. I was just a little confused. 
but not anymore. That mask suits you. Of course it does. It was made for me. I guess I should thank you. I won't say this is thanks to you, but if we hadn't talked, my mind wouldn't have changed. Well, you're welcome. If you keep this up, it won't be long before you're a Septentrion. Why is a mask no, doesn't muffle I don't need voice. some worn out title like Septentrion anymore. I want to be more. The best of the best. A title from someone else wouldn't suit me. My name itself will be synonymous with strength. So the highest title in the OSF will be Shiden? <laughs> I don't think anyone would want that. <laughs> that's fine. That strength is only for me to achieve. I don't think that's quite right either. But I get the gist of it. Then I'll do my best to be the strongest Yuito. <laughs> <laughs> now there's a title that's far from your reach. You have a lot of work to do. Oh, hey. Oh, that really didn't, uh... Is he over here again? No, he's in there. That really didn't, uh, bring us up to... To bond six. Yeah, it didn't bring us up to six. Wow, I'm surprised. It seemed like his uh his last uh bond episode. Oh well. All right, so you're done. You're done. Did we do Kagero yet? We did not. Let's do Kagero. We have a couple things to give him. I'm pretty sure he just gave me this as a gift, and I'm gonna give it back to him. <laughs> but it's a different one than the one he gave me. Oh, cool. Unless this is a different volume than the one he gave me. Oh, hell yeah, reach Team Bond level 5. Kasane, Shiden, Kagero, Kyoken, Akiya have been recognized as a team with a strong bond ability are allowed to win the White Battle. Oh, hey! I actually really like the White Battle of it, so I think I'm gonna put those on if they look good. Okay, I like that one. Uh, yeah, that one's good. Well, those are all pretty good. Oh, I like the white one a lot better. Kagero. Yeah, I think that goes. Nice. Now everyone's wearing white. Hell yeah. Give you the rest of your gifts. Lunar Glow. Did I already give one of these to someone else? Good taste. I still think that wine bottle or alcohol bottle in the back looks really cool. Okay, one more gift. This one should. I think this one will push him over. Bond level six. If not, hopefully his bond episode will. Really? Thanks. I actually don't know if uh if doing the team bond episode actually increases everyone's individual bonds. That didn't max him out. Let's see. If his bond episode does, hopefully. Oh, Yuito. Sorry, I have some minor business to take care of. Okay. I guess I'll see you later then. I haven't really seen him since we talked. I wonder where he's going on his minor business. Hey, Yuito! I heard a strange report. Something about Kagero being placed oh. into custody at OSF headquarters. What? What happened? I don't know the specifics, but the chief may have figured out that he's the one who killed Chairman Sumeragi. This is moving too fast. It's my brother, so he might do something rash. 
How did Kakuro get himself caught so easily? I'm going to see if I can get to the bottom of this. I bet he willingly gave himself over. Kaito! What are you doing? I'm doing what you couldn't. I'm finishing this. Huh. How very decisive of you, Chief. An execution with no trial. I like the cut of your jib. Don't be stupid. Nothing will change if you go through with this. You're a fool if you think I'm going to let you stop me. I'm not as forgiving as you. Not as forgiving? I always thought you were much nicer than him. You can talk all you want, but don't think it will change your fate. I'm going to make you pay for your crimes with your life. Oh yes, please do get on with it. I'd honestly prefer it that way. What did you say? Kagro? I know I need to atone for what I did, but really, repentance is so not my style. Plus, I come from the same time as Yakumo, your ancestor. People can only live for so long. So, if you can just go ahead and pull that trigger and put an end to this, Chief, I'll thank you from the other side. <sighs> now! Put the gun down, Kaito. I won't let you kill Kagero. Why do you protect him? There isn't a single reason to let him live. Even putting aside my emotions as his son, killing Joe Sumeragi is a serious crime. He was necessary for the future of this nation. Not only did he steal our father, he stole our country's future. <sighs> I know that. That's why I won't kill him. That's why I won't let him die. Kagero has a responsibility to build a new future and replace the one he stole. Until he fulfills that, he can't die. <sighs> I won't let him die no matter how much he wants to. So please, leave Kagero's life in my hands. Fine. I understand. I don't like it, but he's yours. For now. Thank you. I appreciate it. If you make any wrong moves, there won't be a next time. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind. I didn't expect to see uh, Kaito in the Did you episode. get caught on purpose? I just wanted to set things straight for everyone. The chief is your brother, which means I killed his father too. So I thought it best to face him, at least once. Just like I did with you. I meant to have a peaceful conversation, but one thing led to another and... No. I think you were well aware that my brother would probably kill you. The way I was talking? That was a bluff. I knew he wouldn't pull the trigger. I still have things I need to do. I'm pretty sure that's only half true. Well, who knows for sure. Could you just stop being so shifty, just for once? You may want to die, but I won't let you. Like I said, your life is in my hands now. You'll live in my father's place, and you will fulfill your responsibility. <sighs> Thanks. Are you sure you want to thank me? You said it yourself, dying would have been easier. Still, I feel like I should thank you. Because of you, I have another reason to live now. I was totally empty. I felt almost like a ghost. But you believe I'll take responsibility as long as I live, so... I guess I can't just run away. Kagero. I used to only think about the past, so I never really looked at what was there, right in front of me. The responsibility to build a new future. Well, you did grace me with your trust. I'll do all I can to make it happen. Good. So will I. And I'll be keeping a close eye on you as well. All right. Well, I guess it's time to contribute to society. Let's go out for a night on the town to revitalize New Himuka's economy. <laughs> Seriously? Your ability to change gears like that will never cease to amaze me. Thanks. Now, we're gonna party all night. Oh boy. Kagero never changes. Look, being the way I am, you might never take me seriously no matter what I say. Although it may not seem like it, 
I really consider you a great man who I trust. Thanks. I didn't think you thought of me like... <laughs> Did you really think you could tease me like that and it'd work? See, that's what I mean. You didn't take me seriously. I'm trying to have a serious conversation here. So, you just stay the way you are. If you do, I'm sure I'll be able to keep supporting you. Bond level 6. Heck yeah. Okay, the amount of time you can remain invisible after hitting with an attack increases. Okay. When Congress in the chance, your chance for FCS invisibility to automatically activate when your health goes below 30. Ooh. Well, so far it seems like having a... I love you! <laughs> What's with that face? <laughs> what did you expect? I appreciate the sentiment, though. Um... What was I going to say? I lost my train of thought. Oh, um, it seems like having Kagero and Gemma in the party so far would have the best benefits because they both have things that activate in the middle of combat and only when they're in the party. Okay, uh, did we do? I don't think we did Arashi. Did we? We didn't. She's only five. Okay, let's do her then. Did we already? I wonder if when we called Fubuki over last time, that was her final you bonding have a good though. eye. Episode. If that was the case, I'd be a little surprised because um, I don't know. It didn't seem to have as big of a conclusion like uh, the other ones have. Then again, she wasn't. Hmm. She's probably dealing with like the least major problem out of anybody. All right, come on, let this get me to six. You know what I like. Thanks. to people who can't slack off. I've started to understand you. That that's your way of cheering me on. So thanks. It's nothing like that. I just noticed that you often hold back out of concern for others. I'm just trying to get you to do what you want a little more instead. Because we're friends. Yeah, thanks. I've been thinking recently, maybe I should take a page out of your playbook. Why are she so tiny? All right. Psychokinesis reacceleration. While well, I say active, the hypervelocity uh, gauge charges a little bit every time a psycho. Oh, a psychokinesis. Okay, so it recharges whenever I beat something now and whenever I use my psychokinesis. That's good. It seems like the two of us are pretty compatible. We both make each other better. Yeah, Her box I'm happy I can help you, too. Haru Shifu, is that what that says? The umbrella thing's in the way. Well, alright. Uh, who's left? Got I keep hitting the, uh, the map button. I've been playing, uh, Ender Lilies recently, and you open the, uh, menu button with the same button you open the map with in this game, so it's just confusing me. Alright, uh... So she didn't, we did, we couldn't get him there. Uh, Sugumi, there wasn't... I'm gonna check one more time, but I could have sworn there was... Nothing to buy for Sugumi. Yeah, see, there's, there's nothing to buy for her, so I... I can't get her up to six. I can't get caught. I mean, I caught her, uh... She didn't. So... We saved Kasani for last, so where is... Uh, where'd you go? There you are. Hello, Kyoko. I have gifts for you. I think I have a lot of gifts for you, because I can give you your... This thing, I think, last time. I finally got that, uh... Uh, spawn yawn thing I needed. This 
house is nice. Ah, oh, so she likes listening to music. That's her Maybe I'll talk to Arshi for a change. We just talked to Arshi. Exorcist Crystal Ball. Why does she like astronomy and all that? Oh, this is wonderful. I thought it was the, the stones you tell, Are you hungry? Does it hurt anywhere? Would you like a massage? Power I'm Crystal fine. Balls. Oh no, I overdid it again. But you give off this vibe that makes me just want to protect you. <laughs> that's nice. Alright, uh, time increased. Oh, now I can make three? Oh, that's gonna be fun. I feel so much closer to you lately. It feels very warm. It's a little embarrassing, but I feel better talking with you, too. Okay. Got it. Let's get for this one first. Red Quartz. Looks purple to me. Thank you. Actually, hmm. oh, this is wonderful. I'm gonna try giving one of them a gift that already has the check mark on it, so I've already given it to them before, and see if that does anything. Yuito, perfect timing. Could you come and help me in the kitchen? Okay, what's the matter? <laughs> what is this? I can't really see with the sensor in place. What in the world is on that plate? I thought I'd reward everyone with some homemade cooking oh, for all the hard work cook? they've been putting uh -oh. in. What? This is food? It has a really intense smell. That must be from all the spices. I'm actually not very good at cooking. This is beyond not very good. <laughs> I wanted to get your advice because I know you're a really good cook. I want to make everyone happy. I see. Well, if that's the case, I'd love to help you. I'm not sure what exactly I can do about this, though. Thank you. You're a lifesaver. Okay, I'll start with a vegetable stir fry. Can you watch me? Done. Vegetables are so important for a balanced diet. Hmm, why is this being censored again? I don't think this has much nutritional value. Let's start with something more simple, like fried eggs. Done. That was really simple and easy. Oh, oh my. The sensor I, again. What did you miss up so fried strange. eggs? How can you do this just from frying an egg? I almost feel like giving up. Now, what dish is coming next? Ow! Are you alright? I'm sorry. Hold on. It'll stop hurting if I take a short break. Are you sick or something? It's something chronic. I've had someone else's memories implanted inside my brain as part of my mission. The memories of Dr. Hitoyo Pope, Togetsu's founder. They sometimes give me headaches. One time, her memories temporarily became stronger, and I almost forgot who I was. That sounds really dangerous. Yes, I may have fought her off once, but I never know when her memories will surface again. I thought I'd cook to distract myself, but it didn't work. I wonder if this will plague me for the rest of my life. If this doctor's memories are a part of you, then maybe. Y yes you're right. I don't mean that in a bad way. I've been worried lately, too. You have? Yeah. There's so much I don't know that could happen with my brain or with the world. 
But I don't let these situations stop me. I keep moving forward. That led me to become friends with all of you. The future always comes with a sense of uncertainty. But it's not necessarily bad. I'm sure you're right. I never felt uncertain or worried when I was in Togetsu. In exchange, I had to bury all my feelings. Right now, I'm scared about the future. But I get to live my life the way I want. Yeah, you're so animated now. Thank you. I'm scared of the doctor's memories because I care so much about who I am now. Okay, my headache is gone. Let's get back to cooking. All right. Let me try to think of a dish you can actually make. I know. How about a rice ball? Oh, that's very homey. What should I wash the rice with? I'll make the rice. You just shape them. <laughs> okay, that was some hard work. But we managed to do it. I think. They didn't quite end up in the shape you showed me. But I'm pretty proud of them. Let's go hand them out to everyone. I see you cooked. I just remembered about oh, something got I the have sense to do. Would it be again. okay if I left for a while? Is this a rice ball? I'm sensing something sinister. I'm not getting near that thing. <laughs> Keep it away from me. <laughs> they're so scared. I understand where they're coming from, though. Don't worry, they're edible. See? Oh. You're right. They don't look great, but they taste all right. I guess if you say they're okay. Oh, you're right. It's good. No, it actually tastes good. <sighs> we managed to get everyone to eat them. They had pretty nice things to say as well. This is amazing. It's the first time I've ever been complimented on my cooking. Really? <laughs> I guess that's not surprising. I didn't know you'd be so happy. I'm most happy about learning and applying something new on my own. Something that wasn't from Dr. Pope's memories. I see. I guess making rice balls wasn't something the doctor bothered to learn. If I continue to challenge myself like this every day, and bring joy to people, building my own memories, maybe one day the doctor's thoughts will become a thing of the past. I'm sure you're right. I wouldn't feel this helpful if it wasn't for you. Thank you. You don't need to thank me. Knowing that you watch over me gives me the motivation I need to do my best every day. I can't believe that little child is standing here in front of me right now, teaching me so much. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> you don't need to compare me to the past. No, you're not a child anymore. I have to grow too. To not fear the uncertainty of the future, and to move forward. Just let me know if there's anything I can do for you. Really? The next time, I'll make rice balls without your help, and you can taste uh -oh. them. <laughs> what? Uh, I shouldn't have said anything. Oh, rip you, Ito. Didn't I have something to talk to Gamma about? And that didn't get me to, uh, six, unfortunately. Uh... Alright, so I'm fairly certain we only have Kasane left, but let me just check everybody again. Oh, I didn't do Hanabi? Oh, she has another another Bond episode. Oh wait, I did cheat it. Uh, Luca... Gemma, Don. I'm curious. Did I just not do um, Hanabi's Bond episode, or is this a new one? Because if that's the case, I'm gonna do. I just want to test something. Where she did. Give you the same gift. Not bad. Yuito? Oh, okay, so I can't give them always being repeat so gifts. I misjudged you. I realized that right away, but 
I just couldn't change the way I acted. Yeah, I know. You've got a bad mouth, but you're a good so guy. We can get everybody to a little looks. aggravating, but it's fine. I, uh, I think I should be more sincere with you. So I hope we can be friends. Heck yeah, okay. Uh, during SAS, activate an uh, electrokinesis dome on the fifth weapon strike. Attack and deal damage in a large area. Ooh. We'll have to try that out. I think I might end up liking the, uh, Hanabi's fire tornado more, but we'll see. I can't believe how close you and I have become. I must have all the bakis. Takes a lot for me to say something like that, so you better appreciate it. I'm surprised to hear you see that. Thanks. There she is. Do I have any... Let me, let me go buy a, an extra gift for Smoky. No, not six yet. All right, let's buy the other ones. Give her that one. Let's buy one of these. Let's buy a few things just in case. Hopefully this works. It just worked for shooting. I hope that wasn't a a weird glitch or anything. So I just assumed oh, since he got the check mark, it was like, oh, you gave it to them. And since the stuff gets placed around the uh, the hideout, I was like, oh, you can probably only give it to them once. I think I gave her another one of these big ones. If this doesn't work, then I'm just gonna assume that was a weird uh, fluke that happened with she did. Nope, there before, we go. You should take care of yourself, but you don't have to worry about it. <laughs> what? Why? Um, I still want you to take care of yourself, but I found a better way. Don't laugh, okay? I will water you. I'm going to take care of you. I won't laugh. Thank you. Oh, that was nice. I like Alex. Sugumi, my bad. Okay, uh, while the SS is activated, you can deplete enemies' crush gauges even more and defeat defeat enemy will make it always drop an oh always drop an item. You know? That would be very helpful when I was farming this other stuff. You and I are closer now, right? <laughs> that makes me happy. Yeah, I'm happy too. I'm glad we're together. Right, so that's the case. Let's buy a bunch of stuff for Kyoka. Uh, here we go. 
another one of these. Let's get two of these. Hopefully that's enough. Alright, Kyoko, where are you? Are you cooking again? No. Oh, there she is. I don't think I've actually ever seen her sitting at the table. For me to oh, just well, treat you one. like a child oh. if I don't think about it. But you're a fully respected soldier. I need to be more careful. <laughs> I've gotten used to it already. <laughs> I'm trying to take care of you, but it's like you're the one taking care of me. Maybe that's how people support each other. It Thank is you. indeed. Alright. One more copy. Wait. Oh, one more copy of a psychokinesis object. So does that mean three or four? Three, okay. So five only gave me an extra clone, but now with six, I can actually throw three things instead of two things. I feel like Seems we have weird, an understanding but... of each other you just can't put into words. Yeah, like we have some sort of deep connection. Maybe this is what it means to be a family. Wait, I've maxed out everybody but Kasane, but... Feels like I'm missing two Bakis. Huh. Interesting. Alright. It's time to do Kasane's Bond episode. And then we'll do the Team 1. Where is she? She's over here. Alright, Kasane, take my gifts. She's already at five, so she should max out. This is after this stuff. Thanks. He really did like Naomi. I think I need to talk to Kyoka. Man, you two, we already talked to Kyoka a bunch. Okay. timing. Will you go to Kikuchiba with me? Yeah, sure. Why Kikuchiba? I thought we could go somewhere to talk like when we went to Mizuhagawa. We won't need lunch. I just want to talk. Oh, got it. No lunch, huh? I guess that was too much last time. Came here together might before. Come back, so I might mute again. A lot has happened since scene. then. Before? When was that? You don't remember? You asked me if there was anyone I liked out of the blue. You know, when we went looking for Captain Seto's fountain pen. You said you were doing a background check. Oh, 
that. Back then, I had no idea that we'd get caught up in something that involved the whole world. Not just us, but everyone around us, too. It's nothing we could have expected. You're right. Hey, sorry to interrupt. Two large groups of others were confirmed near you. There are a lot of them. More than you usually see around there. It shouldn't be a problem for you two, but be careful. So, how should we go about this? Let's split up. We can work more efficiently that way. All right. I'll go this way. I'll contact you when I've cleaned most of them up. I'm counting on you. <sighs> Wataru wasn't joking. That sure is a lot. I hope Kasane is okay. Than I thought. How are things with you, Yuto? Kasane? What's going on? Wataru, what's the situation? Damn, I can't get through. Is the network down? I can't even use SAS. Calm down. It's all right. I can do this. It's so uh -oh. quiet. I can't hear anyone. It's like I'm really alone. No, this is what normal really is. I was so used to always being connected to someone through SAS. If I lose my power and go back to being a dud, it will always be like this. It's strange, though. I'm not as scared as I thought I would be. I thought I would feel more lonely. Is it because I'm stronger? <laughs> Probably not. I can feel it in my bones that Kasane is fighting somewhere. Even by herself. I know she won't give any ground. So I can't just die here. I think that just basic enemies. Keep it up. Come on. Can't run until we take down the enemy. Alright, let's go find Kasane. Cycle through my items, was gonna heal. Too much for me. No, Kasane's on her way. I 
should weaken it as much as I can until then. I'm gonna see if that takes some doing. Come on! Still down? We almost got it. We can finish this if we attack together. Let's do this! That was a close one. It was? I wasn't really all that worried. I assumed you would act when you did. <laughs> I was nervous. I guess we can work together even without SAS. I don't think I could have pulled it off with someone else. Thank you for getting the timing right. <laughs> it's nice to hear a compliment from you. You're always so harsh. Am I? Well, whatever. Let's make our way to the top. We can see the moon from here. It's beautiful. So, what was it you wanted to talk about? When the fighting is over, what do you plan to do? I have a vague idea. It might be too grand, so you'll probably laugh. I won't laugh, no matter what it is. Thanks. I want to change the world. Change the world? Yeah. We've both seen a lot of bad things in this country. The world that we live in now is built on so much sadness and sacrifice. That's true. Suo, Seiron, and Togetsu. There were people suffering everywhere. So many people's lives were turned upside down because of the desire for the strongest power, or using powers to alter time. It's got to end. This world can't exist just for powers. I won't let what happened to Nagi happen to anyone else. That's the least I can do for him. That's why I want to change the world. To make it a place where people don't have to rely on powers for everything. I know it will take a long time, but I feel like as a dud, I'm the perfect person for it. 
A dud, that's right. How's your head? They were saying you might lose your power. No big change at the moment, but if it really comes down to it, I'm prepared to become one again. You're pretty calm about it. The way you were talking, I thought you would be a little depressed. I mean, it will be inconvenient, but you know what? I'm not the least bit afraid. I thought the same thing when the network went down. Like I was fighting back to back with you, even without SAS. You thought the same thing? I wonder if that's what it feels like to lose your power. We're not just connected by SAS. Even if we can't see each other's faces or hear each other's voices, the most important thing, our connection, doesn't go away. So I'll be alright. That's good. When we first met, I honestly thought I wouldn't be able to count on you in a fight. <laughs> I kind of had a feeling you thought that. But you're different now. I think you really can change the world. <sighs> Thank you. Don't mention it. I'm relieved as well. I feel like I can leave this world to you. Leave? What are you planning to do? Well, I haven't decided on a clear goal yet. But I've sort of been thinking of something outside this world. Like, outside of New Himuka? She wanna go to the moon? You mean the moon? I've been thinking about it ever since I heard humanity came here from the moon. Outside this world is another world that I know nothing about, filled with people who are a mystery to me. They're suffering, just like the people here. They are attacked by others, and turning into them. Once I realized that, I couldn't ignore it. I thought maybe I could help somehow. The moon. I thought I understood the first time I heard about it. But the scale is just too big. It doesn't seem real at all. I certainly never thought about saving the people that live there. You really are amazing. I'm not amazing at all. I just don't want to regret neglecting the people I could have protected. I always felt that you were the kind of person that would step up to protect people, even if you're alone. It's almost as if you're not afraid of anything. I looked up to you when I was a kid. I wanted to be just like you. I think you're plenty like me, and you're giving me too much credit thinking I'm never afraid. As you said before, the most important connections never go away. You mean, Naomi? Not just her. The memories of my mother, and the time I spent with all of you. The only reason I'm not as afraid as I should be is because I know they'll always be with me. I know that they'll always be here, inside my heart. So, even if you're alone, you're never really alone? I kinda like that. That's why I feel like I can go anywhere, even going beyond the sky. <laughs> I know that sounds like a dream. I think you can do it. No, I know you can. Thank you. So, it looks like you and I will be going our separate ways. It won't just be us. I think everyone will find their own path and slowly drift farther apart. Yeah. I'd be lying if I said it didn't make me sad. But even apart, we're still friends. Yeah. Okay. We should probably get back to the hideout. There's so much to do before and after a fight. We just have to take care of what's in front of us. Though, listening to you made me excited for the future. It won't be easy for either of us, so let's do our best. Both in our own places. Absolutely. I promise I'll make a better future, no matter how long it takes. You can take your time, but if you take too long, I'll bring peace to the moon and come back before you're done. Oh, so it's a competition now. I know you hate to lose. This seems like an endgame cutscene. Instead of just a regular bunny, man. Line beyond time. There's a lot that I wish hadn't happened, right, so but I'm grateful I met you, Nito. <laughs> well, I am your Baki, after all. <laughs> 
I did say that. I think of you now as a comrade. We'd understand each other even if we were far apart. At least I think we would. Well, level six. Changes so the hands only to control objects in a larger area. Ooh, so it does even more damage. Now I think. Oh, there we go. Because I finished everybody. That's how I get the last doll. Okay. Now we have all of them. Yuito, thank you for being a part of my life. So I, think... I want to thank you too. I'm the way I am now because I met you. I'm a little embarrassed I just said that. <laughs> I think I'm going to end it here because we are at an hour and I know the team bonding episodes are pretty long so I don't want to make this episode too long. So save. Alright. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll finish the uh, Team Bond episode next time and probably continue with the story. I think we're very close to the end. So hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you later.